Hey, Gorilla family, how are you doing today? Welcome back to the patio outside to hear the Gorilla Grills. I'm Chef Ed here, you're actually your host, and I have Don behind the camera helping me out, making me look good once again. He does a great job of that, I'm gonna tell you what. Um, today, we're actually doing a bacon wrap meatloaf, but a little bit of a switch on things today, guys. We actually have a wild boar meatloaf today. Yeah, you heard me, a wild boar meatloaf. You don't have to use wild boar all the time, but you can use wild ground pork if you want. You can use beef if you want, but this is something that we had today that we had available. Um, we're going to do a couple different things because we are using wild boar today. That's we're going to be adding a little bit of bacon to the inside of it as well as going to be wrapping it on the outside. Uh, we're going to add a few different flavors just because it is wild boar and it's so lean. I'm going to tell you one thing, it's going to turn out really good, really fun, really great using a cast iron pan inside of our silverback. You heard that right. We're using a cast iron pan. We're going to roll it. We're going to kick some butt with it. We're going to eat some bacon. Wait, did I say we're going to eat some bacon? We're going to eat some pork and then we're going to eat some more bacon. So with that being said, get ready. Here we go. What we have today, we have our fresh ground, actually our wild boar. Yes, we are using wild boar. It's nice and red and rare. Can't you see that? It's nice and red because it has very little fat to it. So that's where the bacon comes into play. We've got to add a little bit more bacon and then we're going to add a little bit more bacon on top of that. We're going to add our eggs, our breadcrumbs, our fresh white onion, our smoked Gouda cheese. Yes, I said smoked Gouda. Salt, granulated garlic, fresh garlic, and our fresh ground black pepper. Gorilla family, here you go. We got our bacon wrapped boar meatloaf. Our pig on pig on pig with more pig. Let me tell you, this is an incredible recipe. It's fun. Everybody loves bacon nowadays. We're gonna throw this in our silverback over here at 350 degrees for about 45 minutes to an hour, depending on what on your grill. But make sure it hits 160 to 165 degrees on the internal temperature when you do. Grab a thermometer, throw it in there, pull it out when it's ready. If it's not ready, put it back in for a little longer. You know, we just wanna make sure we're safe, we're good, and we're ready to rock and roll. Good to go. Enjoy, we'll see you back here in about an hour. Okay guys, here it is. Here's your final product, easy as heck. Simple as can be, we made the mix, threw it in a pan, wrapped it around with bacon, and you were done. That simple, that easy, impressive. Nobody's ever seen anything like this. And so it's a showstopper. You bring some people over, you got something they've never seen. Look how easy that was. Thank you very much for joining us for this recipe today. Like, share, subscribe. See you next time.